Kikomen Corporation Kiko Man Zushi Weishi Kikomen Kabushiki Gaisha is a Japanese food manufacturer. Its main products and services include soy sauce, food seasoning and flavoring, mirin, shochu, and sake, juice and other beverages, pharmaceuticals, and restaurant management services. Kikomen has production plants and offices in Japan, the US, the Netherlands, Singapore, Taiwan, China and Canada. Kikomen is the most popular brand of soy sauce in Japan and the United States. The village of Sapamir in Groningen, the Netherlands, is the European headquarters of the company. A plant on the site began operations in 1997 and now produces over 400 million liters of soy sauce per annum. History Founded in 1917, it is based in Noda, Chiba Prefecture, Japan. It is a combination of eight family-owned businesses founded as early as 1603 by the Mogi and Takanashi families. Kiko, which means tortoise shell in Japanese, and man, meaning 10,000, were chosen first as the trademark and later as the company name. This was to symbolize longevity, as according to Japanese folklore a tortoise lives for 10,000 years. This symbolism is found in Kikoman's logo, which is a rebus that consists of the Chinese character for 10,000 surrounded by a hexagon, representing a tortoise shell. See Japanese rebus monogram for more examples. Products Soy sauce Kikoman soy sauce is naturally brewed see soy sauce, traditional production. After soaking in water for an extended period, soy beans are steamed at high temperature before they are mixed with crushed roasted wheat. Salt is added, which acts as an antibacterial agent and preservative. Next, a genus of the Aspergillus fungus is added to the mixture and left for three days to create shoyu koji, the base for the soy sauce. This base is then transferred to a tank and mixed with a saline solution, which creates a mash known as maromi. Several months of aging follow, when various organic processes occur including lactic acid, alcoholic and organic acid fermentation take place to create unique flavors. The maromi is then mechanically pressed through layers of fabric for around 10 hours to extract the raw product. In the last part of the process, the raw soy sauce is left to separate for three to four days, then pasteurized using steam, which also stops any enzymic activity. The final product is then ready for inspection and bottling. Kikoman has a distinctive bottle for its soy sauce, designed by Kenji Ekin in 1961. Kikoman also makes teriyaki sauce, which was introduced in 1968. <laughs> Gallery